two fixed wires cross each other perpendicular so that perpendicularly so that each so that they do not actually touch yet are close to each other. Equal currents I flow in each wire as shown in the figure above. In what region regions will there be some point of zero net magnetic field? Okay. So the idea with the wires not touching is that they're touching and then the um um, would that matter? I don't know. Long story short, wire, uh, current flowing, magnetic field is, or a wire, I'm going to use L for line, is going to be mu naught I over 2 pi R. That's supposed to be an I up there. And it's going to go around in a circle. It's going to be a circle that goes around the wire. So it's specifically going to use a right-hand rule. You place your thumb in the direction of the wire and you curl your fingers. So for the vertical wire, thumb points down, wrap your fingers, and it's going to go this direction. So for this current going down, it's going to be coming out of the board there, into the board there. And I'll do, and I'll, um, do it up here as well, just so it's easy to see. All right, so out of the board, out of the board, into the board, into the board. Excellent. So now, contrast color, current going this way, thumb along the direction of current. I know it looks backwards because the webcam is flipped. That's okay, you'll get over it. Uh, thumb in the direction of current, wrap your fingers, and we get um, out of the board here, out of the board here, into the board here, into the board here. And so we wanna know in which areas will the magnetic field be zero? So for it to be zero, we're gonna to have to find places where they, um, we have destructive interference. So the two points are gonna be here or here because in the top left and bottom right quadrant, I guess that'd be quadrant two and four, um, we get a magnetic field going in and a magnetic field going out, therefore they can oppose each other, therefore they can cancel each other out and zero is a possibility. Um, the only way that these two quadrants could be zero is if current I was zero, and we're going to kind of assume that it's not zero, otherwise the problem would be kind of silly. So that's how I'd approach this problem. Hope it helped. See you next time.